All right, so in this video, I want to cover this central terminal. This is the earth ground or earth reference. Now these two power supplies are what are called floating power supplies. So they're floating because they are not internally connected to here. Now, if I want to use the earth reference as my reference in my circuit, I can just connect that to that. So that means this terminal is now connected to the same uh, ground reference in my outlet. So I can connect to something that is electrically connected to ground. And then just with my single probe, I can measure 15 volts. Now if I go over here, it's floating. So there's, it's not measuring any voltage. So it's not internally connected. So if I can connect that, so I need two jumper wires to go from here to there and from here to there. And then I can measure from my reference voltage. I've got 15 volts and 15 volts. So now I can also still use this dual power supply in the non-floating uh, configuration to get a plus minus 15. So I just need to move this over like as in before, connect that to the positive. So again, if I have my uh, multimeter probes, so I connect to, from this as my reference point to here, this is negative 15, and from here to there, it's 15 volts. So the only difference between having these uh, from ignoring that is now this is a plus minus 15 volts that is referenced to earth ground. And you can use this just like others, other circuits. So I can connect my ground to here and connect to my ground and my breadboard and connect to the most negative potential. I'll connect that to there and most positive potential connect that to here. So again, this is a plus minus 15 volt, and I'm going to measure on the breadboard from re in reference to ground. And so I've got my positive 15 volts, as you can see up here on the multimeter, there's a positive 15 volts, and my other is negative 15 volts. Now the only difference between the regular plus minus 15 floating is that my reference is also earth mains.